A family in Poway is asking for help to recover a stolen jacket. It belonged to Ryan Golden. He passed away, and that jacket was his most prized possession. As our 10 News reporter Jared Ahrens explains, Ryan's family is hoping for a holiday miracle. This is all his graduation stuff. Pictures on a wall, a single guitar, and a locket filled with ashes are constant reminders of what Don Cox lost last Christmas. He was more of a son than a nephew to me. Her nephew, Ryan Golden, was killed while walking along Highway 67. He got hit by one car and thrown into the other lane and hit by four more cars. His body identifiable only through fingerprints. The coroner and the mortuary were able to save a few patches from Ryan's favorite jacket, which he was wearing the night he died. He had this one on him too when he died. They were able to get this one off. His aunt took those patches and some more and made a replica of his coat. She said it made her feel like she still had a part of Ryan with her. But the first time she wore it out of the house, it was stolen. I sat my jacket down for just a second to grab something and I had, I could see it out of the corner of my eye and then I turned around and my jacket was gone. Facebook posts flooded social media asking whoever took it to bring it back. Don still hasn't touched the hangar where it once was. I know it probably sounds stupid, but I feel like if I move the hangar, I'm giving up hope on getting the jacket back. To anyone else, it's just a cool jacket, but to me, that's the last thing I have of my nephew, and I, I can't replace that. In Poway, Jared Ahrens, 10 News. Hopefully someone can mm -hmm. help. The jacket disappeared at Poway's Irish pub. The family just wants to return to the bar. No questions asked. And let's hope somebody does the right thing. Let's hope so. Yeah.